Okay. Below, below. Oh. Hopefully you can still see me. I have a different case on that's not really working or fitting. But hello. I am going to finally rank my favorite anime characters male edition. Um, and we're doing it from the scale of S to D or E, I think. Um, also, this is the first time I'm recording from my computer, like screen sharing and recording me. So it's the editing, I already know it's gonna be a nightmare to edit, but just bear with me, just bear with me. So, <laughs> hold on, I gotta try doing this so you guys can see, that was just the intro. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bear with me because the heat is very loud. The heater's on and it's very loud. Okay, so I'm hitting record. So now you should see what I see. And first off, we're gonna go with. Actually, pause. Whichever one comes up first, oh, we're gonna start with this one. So. So we got right here, because I was going to start with Levi, but we're going to start with our main main. Um, if you don't know him, this is from Jinchi. Jinchi? I'm not really good with names, so it's going to be a lot of this is him. But I'm pretty sure this is Jinchi from... There we go. Okay. <laughs> At first, I was like... Who is this guy girl looking mofo you know because i was like bro this why is everyone in love with him like he he looks like a woman like i literally thought it was a woman right and you know as the stuff goes on all these girls are like in love with him and you're like whatever but the story is so good and it like it makes you fall in love with him because of the stuff he does um this is not real by the way not real that's that's not part of it a lot of edits. This is what he, like, outfit is. This is what he looks like. Purple hair. And, yeah. And he loves Mau Mau. Um, but anyways. It's still going on. The season's not done. And I've seen whatever's out so far. Um, but yeah, let me just say, there's, like... <laughs> where's his shirtless scenes? You see this? You see this? <laughs> Anyways, lovely character. Um, moving on. We're gonna put him in. So, because he looks like a girl, his hair is purple, but his mannerism and like how he plays in the show, we're gonna take in consideration, you know, a little hard to get lover boy, if we can say that. So we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put him in B. You know, because he's he's good. He's not great. He's not like, oh, he's going to trump most of them. I just think, and it's just one season is out right now. So, you know, I just like the lovey-dovey vibe that he's like all over this one girl. And she's playing hard to get. And it's very cute. I love that show. Okay, next one. Let's see which one we get. <laughs> oh, we're staying in the same show. Okay. So this is the officer from um, Apothecary Diaries. Let me just try looking him up. Officer guy. There he is. I don't know his name. Oh, it's right there. It's uh, Lu Luca Wu. Couldn't tell you, but this is him from the same show. You know, there he is with his lovers. Um, not really lover, but he there we go he <laughs> this is not a part of the show but he was good looking like whenever he takes off his little do rag thing whenever he takes that off he looks good and he's just you know the face the body i know there's a scene without his shirt on we can look at it shirtless. Here we go. Yeah. There was one scene. I don't remember what it was, but I'm pretty sure he was... Okay. It's kind of getting weird, guys. What are we doing? Um, 
we'll delete that and just look back at him. I'm pretty sure we don't see where he was shirtless. Either way, he's good looking. I'm going to add him. He's not above Jinchi, so he's gonna be C, you know, because he, if I'm being honest, just seems like a fuckboy, but in the story, he's good looking. He's not a wow, he's not a big wow. Um, oh, here's him flexing his muscle. It looks like only half of the screen is shown. Let me try to change it. Okay. Muscle. Meathead. Gave me fuckboy vibes. That's why he's in C. So we're putting him in C, okay? Sorry, I'm using this as the thing. That's just... I'm not gonna... I told you it's gonna be hard. On to the next one. Let's see what we get. Let's go to the bottom. Oh... Dude, I don't know his name, but this is from Tokyo Ghoul. And every time he came in frame, he's not a main character. He didn't really come in that much, but he was a part of um, the good people side. And bro, every time he came into the show, like in the scene, whatever you're watching, I swear I was like, oh, pucker up, ladies. Like, what is he going to do? What is he going to say? He was a stallion. I'm putting him with B. He is... The gray hair, the old man look, but he's not old. He just had gray hair. Pretty sure he's not old, but look at that. He's fine. I don't hear, ladies and gentlemen, if I look it up, it's going to be To. This is how I found it. Tokyo Ghoul, gray hair. Gray hair guy. Fine. Not him. That's not him. This is him. Um, <laughs> what was his name? Oh, Reaching. Oh, how do I say that? Renji? Yomo? Yomo's pretty cool. I like his last name. But yeah, he was fire. Look how fine that is. And he had, before the, before it even came out, bro, he was wearing, he's wearing legit, I hope the next one is a Jujutsu Kaisen one. But yeah, he's going with B. You know, he wasn't main character. We didn't get a lot from him. He was mysterious and good looking. That's what we're working with. So let's add another one. Let's see. Let's see. I think. Oh, you know which I didn't add into this? I didn't add um, Zoro from One Piece. Yeah, most of these are just mainstream anime. So we have Zeke. This is very easy for me. I knew I was going to put him in because... I would need it some at the bottom, ladies, if we're being right. Like, we need some at the bottom. So, if you don't know who he is, he... No. Attack on Titan. He's from Attack on Titan, ladies, and he is related to Aaron Yeager, aka he's the Beast Titan. Uh, I don't like him. You know, I can see why a lot of people do like him, because, you know, if you're into bearded guys or whatever, and blondes, but... It's giving Adam and Eve to me, you know. This is this is the splitting image when I think of Adam. I don't know why. It's just not... And he's not... He's not an it girl, you know. He wasn't it. And, you know, we already have... Beef with him because our baby daddy Levi didn't like him. So we're putting him in E, you know. I really don't think he's good looking at all. I'm gonna throw him in E. Boom. What was your role? Good question. Okay, let's see what... Oh, I know who this is, actually. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah! Sorry. I'm so excited for this one. If you don't know... Ladies, if you're watching this, you should know, okay? If you are watching this, where there he is um if you're watching this first off see watch all these animes and they're amazing second of all his eyes threw me off you know this is the one thing where i was like yo he's so fine and he's so good with like he takes one arm out and he's like badass okay that's the moral of it he's badass he's the captain for i think number seven which number seven is like og number cool but that's him. Benny Morrow. They just say Benny throughout the show. But, you know, his eyes 
and like the powdered, the pow, pow, pouty lip. He's hot, but I think his hair is not doing him justice. And the eyes, like I fuck with them heavy, but they're just not like it, girl. It don't do it. He's hot. That's why I wanted to put him in here. And I'm like, you know, because he's badass, but he's not it, girl. He's not, he's not fire, fire flames. I'm going to put him at, because he's so cool and like edgy, I'm putting him at A. He's not going to be top dog, but he is, he's A. He's A material. Okay. This is fun. Are you guys having fun? Okay, let's see. Who's this? Is this orange hair? Oh, finally, we're in Jujutsu Kaisen. Okay, this is from Jujutsu Kaisen Naname. If you don't know him, this is very easy. God, this is the only character that I was like, the real life edits, man looks fine. Okay. So, snippets, all of him. Okay, season one, he's wearing these glasses, which they don't do him justice. They're fire, they're cool. His, his like, sword is super cool too, but, like, the glasses, like, babe, no. Your face is so fine to not be wearing those. You show your eyes, you know? Okay, I'm trying to see the photo where, like, someone did, like, a... Um, maybe it was Rhina. It was actually Rhina where I laughed out loud when I saw it, but he is fine, okay? He's badass too. He is so fine. I just don't like the glasses, but this scene, <laughs> bro, this scene, this one, what are you doing? Why are you guys making his, his hands so like masculine too? I don't know. Motherfuckers with the jawline and the cut cheek and the mm, beautiful work of art. He's going in A, no doubt about it. You know, I can't put him at S because... He, if you watch this as a cousin, you know, okay? You, you'll get why he's not in S tier. He's in A tier. Who's this? Let's see this one and choose. Joker. Okay, we're going back to Fire Force. Y'all, most of these guys and animes, I love watching A and B's about, but Joker's a pretty cool guy. Now, is he good looking? Is he good looking because he has a cigarette in his mouth or is he good looking because he's good looking? Mmm. Question, question, question. Well, ladies and gents, he is pale, okay? Very, very pale and long hair. So the hair isn't doing him justice, you know, but the cigarette in his mouth all the time does justice. And, you know, villain, Joker, that is just such a cool title. We're going to throw him in because he's not he's not it girl but he's still cool you know he has some some features that's winning he's winning um with not much from that he's not a main character so if you watch the show you know but he's up there he's he's he gives we'll give him a spot on the chart okay this is this is what we want this is where we are rhina you try to sorry Rainer. Okay. Let me try showing you the photo that I saw when I was I was looking up these photos to put on here. LOL. No. There's like a... Um, I don't know why. I looked at this, y'all. I don't know why they blared it out. Someone just threw something at his head when he was laying down. Like, it wasn't that deep. Um... Let me just say, character development is a big thing. Because you can see this is him in season one and two. Not that good looking. He's a little boy vibes. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to find the photo that I was talking about. Maybe there's someone else. But anyways, this, he looks 
fine as hell in the last season. Like, he popped off with the char character development. Most of them, almost, okay, all of them popped off with the character development in this whole, whole show. So if you haven't watched it, watch it. But, like, dude, the stuff that he went through. And I want to add, while he's up here, and why we're going to rank him where he is, is because his Titan is still hot. He's, like, most of the Titans are like, ew, kind of gross. No, Armor Titan, hot. Dang, I can't find the real life. Maybe if I look it up when I saw it. Anyways, he's hot towards the end. That's my point. His his Titan is hot through the whole show. Oh, it was something like this, dude. Something like this, but dude, <laughs> it looks <laughs> the hair. He looks so fine, and the muscles. Armor Titan, like, dude, muscle, muscle. And he's fine. He's going at... I want to put him at S. I really do. Because he was somewhat of a villain, but he wasn't. I'm putting him at S, dude. He is so fine. Fangirl. Fangirl. I am a fan. Okay. Okay, let's see what... Oh, I know that this one. You can tell. Gojo. Boom. Easy. This one. Ironically. Ironically, you know... I was a Gojo girl to the death, you know. Why do you say Gojo Attack on Titan? Um, but when we're watching the second season, ladies, um, mind you, while I'm recording this, I have ne not ever seen the movie. Just want to put that out there. Crazy, I know. But, like, I was just watching the show, so I didn't really know... The movie had more to do with it so based on just season one <clears throat> and season two he is not the number one mainly because his personality showed more during season two and he's full of himself but i'm not liking the look like without the eye mask thing on he's like this is scary this is kind of scary um so there's megami these are other characters but you know, this is him season two. He's he's hot, but he's not doing it for me anymore. It's not a fan fave. So he's going at A. Surprisingly, he's going at A. And you're like, what? Just wait. Who the hell is this? That's why. Thank you. I'm so glad I picked this one. This is why. Easy putting him at number S, letter S, whatever. Don't come for me because one bad boy two season two such a good looking man oh my gosh oh my gosh i am crazy about him oh. like i'm trying to I'm trying to hold it in not to yell right now but he is so fine this is the movie this is the show he is so good looking i'm in love Sorry, look at him. Knee scenes with the bags under his eyes. You can relate to him so heavy. And he's just like, fuck this. I'm like, yeah, I'm on your team. Whatever you're doing, I'm on your team. Uh, anyways, villain made him twice as sexy. That's not real. There is one scene where he is somewhat naked, which is like kind of weird. Like, I'm not gonna lie, babe. You do not look good in this scene. You don't. But every other one, he's just a very fascinating character to me. Um, but I just think he looks so fine with his hair down and like up. It looks fine as hell too, like black hair. And again, with the jaw, the jaw line cuts. Like we don't have to even question that. If their jaw line is sharp as hell, they're going on the S tear, tear, whatever. Anyways, black hair, I'm not explaining myself Fine. Fine as hell. Where are we? Next one. Is this Levi? Okay. Good. Now we're somewhat in order, ladies. Again, jawline. I want to put him at S tier because he's so badass. But is he... Look at this. We know his height. We know his height. Let's see this. 6'3"? Gito 6'3"? Who else do we have at S? Rhina? The hell? 
What the hell? Guys. Mm. 6-1. 6-1. Oh, you guys can't really see it. Let me change the screen again. Okay. Okay, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Again, I told you it's gonna be hard. Brian is 6-3. Let me go back. Gito 6... Sorry, 6-1. Six, Gito 6-3. And now we're left with... If you don't know... <laughs> Levi's height? Look. Right there. Second one. 5-3. Babe, I'm 5-3. I'm sorry. I'm 5-3. I wear he heels. It's done. It's over. So... Mm, it kind of knocks him down, but <sighs> let's see, because he was, and to, to be honest, still is number one in my heart. He's so badass. Like, if you haven't seen this scene in season two, um, where he is kicking ass, taking names, and I think it's season two, or I'm pretty sure it's three, when Kenny, Kenny comes in. He's just adorable. I love him. He slays. He's a, a short king. So, you know, I want to put him at A. But because of my... He was number one. And Attack on Titan is my favorite show. I'm putting him at S. He's so badass. You know, because in my head I'm like trying to compare them to. But they're two different shows. So I can't compare Gito to Levi. But let's just say, you know, he is a short king. So, because he's badass and we're an OG fan, we'll, we'll, we'll take it as that. Let's see, who's this? <clears throat> mm. Hands down, best speech ever. Oh, sorry guys. I think his name, I think it's Erwin. Okay. Yeah, because I mix him up with Armin. Because when I was first hearing their names, I was like, dang, those are super similar names. Um, but yeah. His voice, his speech, amazing. That's the only reason he's not going to go all the way at the bottom. Character development, amazing. It's just mm, fine. Fine because of who he is, you know? Like this, this one, fine. When he, you know, I'm pretty sure this is season two. So fine. So, so, so fine. Season one or season two. Um, but he's not it, girl. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. The eyebrows, they look good right here. But they are so bushy. They are so bushy and big for his hair and the comb over. Like, hair when it's messy, fire. Hair when it's combed over and you're playing commander or whatever. I'm pretty sure it was commander. So, oh, sorry, ladies. Oops. Trying to make it look good. I'm putting him at C. Or B, sorry. I'm putting him at B. He's fine. The eyebrows, I'm deducting points from. Um, and the, the comb over, it just really didn't do it for me. Okay. I'm trying to speed through this. Is this? Yeah, okay. He had me at first. Ladies, ladies, li listen up. He had me. Had me at first, because he was fine, you know? He was so cute when he was in season one, season two, and then when he grew out his hair, babe, he lost me. I was like, mmm, long hair just doesn't do it for some people. And you are one of them, you know? You are one of them. He was so fine growing up. And like, this isn't even from the show, and this is a fan art. But like, I just can't, like I'm, not a fan of the bangs and the bun. I'm not a fan. Here's his little character development. But, like, yeah, when he was, like, oh. I didn't know. He was 18 with long hair? Dang. Either way, when he had short hair, he was really doing stuff. He was really winning. But the long hair, like, I just, mmm. The bun is, like, it's not bad. But there's just so many better things you could have done, bun, hun, bun, hun. I'm putting him at, I'm putting him at, I want to put him in the middle. 
I'm gonna put him at B. Cause he's he's he got a bod, you know. They all have bods, but let's be okay, 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 guys. You know, we're gonna keep moving. Oh, okay. Back to the apothecary diaries. Here we are, ladies. Here we are. So this is his assistant. Don't know his name. Let's look it up. It's like I wonder how tall he is. I like how we say that. These people aren't even real. Fire. Fine as hell. See, if he pulled more strands out, he'd look so cute. Um, but because this is mainly how he looks all the time, I'm gonna put him at... It's funny that no one's in D right now. Should I put him at D? You're not that special. I'm putting him at D since nobody's in D. Alright. We might almost be done, guys. Okay. No, we're not almost done. The other captain, aka, I'm pretty sure that they're section three or eight. Sorry, one of them. He's the captain for Fire Force. Fire Force, pause, was actually one of the funniest animes ever that I have seen. Sorry. Oh, and he has such a cool name. I can't say it because, but when you hear it in the show, um, he is fine, by the way. He is so fine because he's muscles. He don't have no special powers like this. Like he's just muscles. He is just muscles, lady. He's fine though. He's fine because of the muscles and he's a captain, a man of, excuse me, a man of authority. I guess you can say he's just so, he's it girl. So I'm putting him at, I'm going to put him at V only because he's badass, but he can't really do much. Okay. He really can't do much. He can fight someone physically, but when we're talking about fire skills, we're still on fire force dude this guy is so badass but it's only because he um he has his little minions with him he's pointless alone uh charno i don't know how to say his name but they did it they really did it they really 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 did it like the i am in love with his hair he's just so badass and like again guys with the with the mask around their eyes like we've never seen his eyes so he's mysterious but he's just so fine too because his kanono whatever is always open so you always looking at his titties i mean his chest his chesticles he's fine his little smirk and shit but the white hair is just doing him justice 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 is served i'm gonna put him at c I don't know, because he is a villain, but he also did save, <sighs> and he's kind of funny because he's, I'm putting him at B, because he was pretty funny in that show. <laughs> that show is so funny. If you haven't seen it, watch it. Okay, this one I wanted to put in here just to put someone down. I know. I know his face is gross, but he's like pretty cool because... Oh, why they gotta do that? With, I don't know how to say his name. With black arm. His power is cool, but I had to put him on here because we both have blackout arms. Except for his is because of his power, yada, yada, yada. I think his power is super cool, but him as a person in this show, no. Mm-mm. What is his name? Is it up here? Uh, right there. Uh, this is what he looks like. I just think this scene is so cool. That looks cool. He looks badass, but he's um. Mm -mm. He kind of weird. He kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie. He's kind of weird in the show, but 
the eyes are not doing it for me. They're scary. But I wanted to put him in because his arm is black, which is so cool. He's so cool. So he's going to get a spot in D because he's cool. He's all right. He's nothing special, though. Okay, ladies, he's nothing special. Sorry if that hurts your feelings. Just okay, okay, okay. We got a lot. <laughs> We're going pretty fast, guys. But this one, if you haven't seen it, please watch this anime and see it through. Because this is one of them where, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna fall off. I fell off and then I picked it back up. But this is a lot of character development show also. And it goes 180 and you gotta see it through. But it's, it's, I would say a work of art in season one. Mm -hmm. Here's his little character development. It's not pretty accurate because those are not actual scenes from the show but this is what he looked like when he started out which why i don't want to give him pointers or anything because bro was not cute when he first started and then towards the end you know miss mysterious with the white hair he only has one eye out so does his his girl um but he wasn't my favorite like this is season two or three i think no, he changed too much where it's not, it wasn't good looking. If his character just stayed the same the whole time, like if his character stayed the same from when he was super cool with this mask, maybe he would get higher rank. Ah, oh, this scene is so good. This is the one where I'm like, it's a work of art. The music, the torture in it, the like underdog story in it, how he comes out, amazing. I love that. So I'm going to put him at C just because he changed so much where I'm like, babe, you lost us for so long. Why? You had it good. What happened? So I'm putting him at C. You know, no hard feelings. It's kind of key. Oh. Who's this? Let's try going in order because I already saw someone. Oh, we already did him, ladies. I'm smiling because I saw someone that I... Oh, <laughs> this is not the one I was smiling at, but okay. This one is, if you don't know, now you know, from Violet Evergardener, out of Evan Garden, and this is Gilbert. This is him. This is her lover. This movie show, I think it's both. So adorable. It's a love one, and it's so cute, and dude, I think in the show he's just so fine because there's like he's just like the protector you know but uh, he's just what what is this from i don't know where that's from that says alex press that's fake um but yeah i'm pretty sure this one's on netflix but he's he's fine He's not super fine, but like the romance part of it is so cute. I'm gonna put him, let's see, let's see, let's see. And here's him with a braid. I'm not feeling the braid. But he was so good to her. You gotta watch that one if you haven't. It will have you in tears. I'm putting him at D. He was short lived. He's fine, but he really didn't do much for me. You know, he's, he's fine, but he didn't do much for me. I think his name is Chu Do. Doesn't my bun look like um <laughs> the guy with the, the Jujutsu Kaisen character with the chain? If you've seen the second series or uh, season, you know what I'm talking about. Anyways, I'm at 30 minutes. I'm recording 30 minutes halfway through, and we're gonna pause because I don't want to upload an hour of a video on YouTube. So I hope you guys enjoyed so far. Second portion is coming out. And then we'll do females, because obviously the baddies gotta get in. Like I said, like, subscribe, watch for part two, because they're not done. There's about four or five left. Okay, bye.